Nice cans. Well, I mean, nice cans. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Let's Play Tales of Monkey Island. Yes, I had to show the cans thing off. Somebody mentioned to me that that, that happened, so I felt I just had to show that. All right. Anyways, I apologize for what happened in the last episode. I'm um, right at the very tail end of it. The recording cut off pretty much because I had no more room on my computer. I have so many recordings from my other LPs, and those take up a surprising amount of room. So I had to delete a few of those, but yeah, the recording stops automatically once you run out of room. But you didn't miss much. Pretty much, they take the chest that has the squawking uh, guybrush parrot, and then they come back and say, okay, it's buried, and that's all that they say. And then I say my outro, but I didn't get a chance to do it. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so we can locate, if we hear our parrot, where the chest is, but uh, we'll do that later. It's on one of those uh, other small islands that we see on the map on our ship, so anyways, uh, I don't think there's anything else to say to them, so let's head deeper into the jungle. Oh, okay, let's look at this cannon first. And I was just to walk slowly all the way over there. What? If it's stationary and there's only one, it doesn't seem like it would, uh, really hit much. It's like the, uh, cannon at, uh, Junon in uh, Final Fantasy 7. Oh well. <laughs> anyway, a jungle just like on um, Flotsam Island. Except I don't think there's any like weird mappy thing to it. These are both there. What else is there? Oh, there's a skeleton. There's a skeleton that's sorted to a tree. We can't really look at it though. Here, nothing for now. Let's go back this other way. Yep, poor skeleton guy. Let's see, let's uh, go this way instead. Run, guy, rush, run. And uh, what's over here? Bakelian ruins? Question mark. More Bakelian ruins. This looks like some kind of old furnace, or maybe a barbecue. Hmm, and that shape looks familiar. Keep that in mind. Nothing we can do with it for now. Let's see anything over here? What's this? Fishing well. Fishing well? They probably meant wishing well. I'm sure it's just a typo. Sure. Why not? So, and there's a coupon here. Free bait. Good for one order of fish eggs. Coupon valid at most participating jerkbait island locations. All right. Neat. Fish eggs, fish eggs. A fishing well. We do have some bait. And we have a hook. Let's do something about that. They say it's a fishing well, so I'll believe them. Okay. Come on, little fishy. Hey, I think I feel a nibble. Ah? Uh, ah? Uh, Come a little closer. Gotcha! Yes! Uh oh, Whoa. oh. <laughs> hey. Hey. Oh, um. Ouch, ouch, ouch! Uh oh. Uh oh. Yeah, Come on. <laughs> Tidebrush Streetwood, obtainer of cranky golden fish artifacts. So, the, <laughs> the artifact of the cranky fish was in there. We got it with our glowy bait. Hooray. So, one artifact down, two to go. So, there's still the seahorse, which is buried somewhere. And... The, uh... Oh, what is it? The turtle. So... Let's uh, search some more. Come on, run, guy bush. There we go. We go this way instead. Yep. All right with the thing. Hey! The clam has almost grown feet. What's the a chuck? 
Guybrush, oh, thank goodness you're safe. Elaine and I were so worried. Forget it, LeChuck. You may have somehow fooled my wife with your voodoo trickery, but not me. But it's true. Thanks to you, I'm a new man. Completely voodoo free. And I have good news, Guybrush. I have found one of the Mer people summoning artifacts. I just need a little help actually getting it. What's your game, LeChuck? Lure me into a false sense of security with kind words and sandwiches and then murder me in my sleep? <laughs> my boy, if I wanted to murder you, I'd just throw you off this cliff. Why wait for you to sleep? <laughs> How reassuring. I completely uh -oh. trust you now. Great! We'll put the past in the past and agree to work together for a change. This is awkward. But okay, I guess we're gonna have to work with the Chuck. Coupon question mark. Rebate. Large oysters. Tasty. For the fish, I mean. <laughs> I try not to eat bait anymore. <laughs> Alright. And hey. That looks familiar. This looks familiar. I believe this thing might have something to do with opening the altar. I just need to figure it out. Yeah, this is just like what we saw over on uh, Flotsam Island, those clamshells that activate the statues. And what's this? Hmm, it looks like it opens somehow. I wonder if there's anything inside. No dice. There must be some trick to opening it. Of course. And it's overlooking this scary part. This We were actually here before, hey. That was that dead end, that first dead end I showed you. And another clamshell. More clamshell locks. I remember these things from Flotsam Island. Don't we have... Ah, we still have it. I could do this all day, but until the Chuck gets another key for the other clamshell lock, this is useless. Uh, I don't know how we already figured that out, but yeah. There's two clamshell locks and they need to both be unlocked. Hmm. Well, let's talk to the Chuck. So, what exactly are you trying to do here? I have surmised that the summoning artifact is somehow locked away within that structure. There has got to be a way to activate it so that we can actually retrieve it. No problem. All we need is another... No, no. No, don't tell me. I need to learn how to do this on my own. If I am going to prove to you that I am on your side, I need to be able to face challenges the same way you do, instead of threatening to cut off your head when I don't get my way. Fine, okay. I'll let you try to figure out how to unlock the artifact, but I will be the one to actually take it. Fantastic! So, like I said, don't tell me how to do this. I'm sure I can figure this out on my own. Uh, so he's going to try to figure out things the Guybrush way. So, you say you're human now, huh? Well, let's just see what happens when I pull off your mask! Ouch! <laughs> Guybrush, stop that! This is not Scooby-Doo. Huh. Okay? Maybe you are human. I still don't like you. Be that as it may, we still must work together to retrieve this summoning artifact. He seems overly nice. That's very disconcerting. If you did anything to hurt Elaine while I was gone, I swear I'll... The only thing I did to Elaine was to pull her from the freezing water along with a bunch of wet screaming monkeys. <laughs> Actually, that kind of sounds like our honeymoon. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, the imagination reels at the uh, implications. So, how much longer do you think? <sighs> I'm so close. I can feel it. <sighs> I'm just not so good with this whole puzzle-solving thing. <sighs> it was so much easier to just kill people until someone did things for you. Maybe you could just give me a hint? Okay, well, try this. He wants to be a, a, an adventure game protagonist. Maybe you should just let me have whatever you're carrying and let me do this. No, Guybrush, I insist. I must learn to do these things for myself. What are you carrying with you? Hmm, well, let's see. I have some breath mints and this thing. It looks just like the thing you used in that clamshell, but mine seems to be broken. Oh, oh ah! I think I've got it now! Oh, wait, no. It seems to be that missing a little work. part at hmm. the bottom. Let's see. So now we have a few options. We can do this uh, scum scumware style, style by using these uh, 
actions here. <laughs> and tell, well, telling them to him, pretty much. Look at... I'm looking at... Claw thingy. It looks like it's missing something. Figure it out yet? Not yet. But I think I'm really close. Yeah, with your rosy cheeks. You look like you're still struggling. You need some more help? Maybe just a little. So yeah, we have okay, to help well, Chuck try this. this. Look at... Right! So, I should look at... Um... Breathments. Breathments. A refreshing blend of 30 mint flavors for the pirate who forgot his toothbrush. Forgot in parentheses. Whatever. Okay, well, try this. Look at... Okay... Look at... Hmm... Uh, altar. Altar. Nice altar. <laughs> That's our line, eh? Okay. Uh-huh. Uh, clamshell lock. I saw you put that seahorse stick thing in it. But other than that, it just looks like an oyster. Huh. Okay. So I'm just uh, you pretty much look at yes. Look at is more for your own benefit than for his. Yourself. Well, I am rather handsome now that I am free of the voodoo curses, but I don't see how that is going to help. <laughs> it's not. I just wanted you to take a long, hard look at yourself and realize what a jerk you've been over the years. Ah, uh, yes. Self-reflection is a humbling beast. I think I'm gonna have to help LeChuck. The guy can't even put together your basic skeleton key of an ancient and highly advanced civilization. Now, to just find the materials. So he's hinting that there's something else you need, and you can probably guess uh, what's missing from the claw thingy. So, um, let's take care of that. Instead of showing you the backtracking, I'll just meet you back at the bait shop in Spinner K. All right, here we are. We got some new coupons. So let's use them. Fish eggs. I'd like some bait, please. Fish eggs. Sure, here you go. All right. Thanks. No problem. I just made them myself. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You what? did what? <laughs> Relax. I'm just yanking your tail. Oh, You're adorable when you squirm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that would be creepy. Oh, that would be creepy. And I honestly think you actually never actually need the fish eggs. I think that's sort of like a red herring right there. But I just got them just for the sake of it. What we really want... I'd like some oysters, please. An oyster. Oh, you're lucky. We only have one left. And it's a doozy. Oh, man. You know, some people refer to the oyster as the love muscle. Really? Maybe that's just to boost its self-esteem. This thing's as ugly as a pile of seagull droppings. <laughs> Alright, so I've uh, got ourselves a giant oyster. Let's see if we can't pry that puppy open. Yeah, we could use our hook for a lot of new things. Let me just crack this sucker open here. <sighs> hey, look, a pearl! A big pearl! Ooh, nice. Where could that come in handy? Well, if we look at the It's an all-purpose tool used by the Vakalian Mer people to activate their mysterious machines. Well, you can kind of see that there's a pearl on the end of it. That seems to be what's missing from LeChuck's key. So, let's go back to LeChuck. This would be much easier if I had a cast iron skillet. Well, you don't, LeChuck. And if you were a real adventure game character, you would at least go look for one. But no, you're just going to stand here and stare. Huh. Alright, let's talk to him some more. Okay, well... So let's start with you. Use. Uh-huh. Breath mints. Right. Uh... Yourself. Yourself. Is this helping? Yes, trust me. It's helping. <laughs> Huh. Well, I did that just for 
just for giggles, but let's give him the pearl. Here, you might need this. Of course. This thing. Yes. <laughs> okay, well, try this. Use rub. Pearl. Hmm. Use it with what? With breath mints. Breath mints. That's not gonna work. I don't see how making it minty can help. You're right. See, now you're learning. <laughs> okay. I could I could mess around and do all the different combinations, but uh, let's just okay, get to it. You yeah. With claw thingy. Ha ha! It fits perfectly! Yep. You now have yourself a fully functional murky. See? That wasn't too hard, was it? No, not at all. So now what? Really? Uh, brother. Uh, I've got to hold his hand the whole time. Okay, well, try this. Use hmm. Merfolk key? No, no. I got it. Hmm. Use with... With... Yourself. Yourself. Like this? That's perfect. Now just, <laughs> what um... What is he doing? Hold that pose what while is I get he my doing? camera, okay? <laughs> oh, Guybrush! What was that? I thought you were going to help me! Okay, okay. Sorry. <laughs> think I found uh, the, I don't think I got that the first time I played through this. That was okay, just well <laughs> try this. <laughs> oh man. Use yes. Murfo key. Right. Uh, uh let's try alter. Alter. I do want to mess around a little bit. That didn't do anything. <laughs> Maybe we should try a different approach. Okay, let's do it right. Okay. You right. Murph right. Clamshell lock. Clamshell lock. Nice. It's working, Guybrush. Of course. Now, I'll just use my key over. Wait! I think I figured it out! Now that I've got my key in place, you can go use yours in the other clamshell. How clever Yeah, are you? smart thinking. Ah. So, let's do it. Donk. And... Aha! It's the oh, will you look artifact. at that? I knew the summoning artifact would be here. Let's go get it! Whoa, hey, I will be the one to get it, remember? That was our deal. You, wait here. Yes, of course. I've got your back. That's exactly what I'm afraid of, but <laughs> thank you. Uh, all right. So? So it this is. is what all the fuss is about. Grab it. Hmm, I'm not getting it out of there that way. Well, we have... Trying to mm, Looks like someone else tried to pry the artifact out of here with no luck. Well, let's use our big old pirate muscles to get it out with this. Come on! Need some help? Nope, I got it. It's just really stuck. <laughs> now this one took me a while to figure out as well. I was like, huh, what do you do about that? Well, you really do need Chuck's help. So you give the prying bar to him. Here. Against my better judgment, I'm going to let you try to get the summoning Please. artifact out of the stone. But only because you're a lot stronger than me. <laughs> but you'd better give the artifact right back, or I swear... Relax, Three Wood. I promise. All you need to know is where to apply pressure. That's true. Dang. Amazing! Oh, too bad. We've done it, Guybrush! Yep. All right. Sure did. 
Now, if I can just... Just look at it. Um, Pure gold. Chuck? A treasure fit for any respectable pirate hold. Okay, come on, Chuck? just let me have... And surrounded with the secret power to summon ancient mysterious beasts of the sea. Now listen here, you fleshy sack of chum! You better be handing over that golden sea turtle, or I'll be handing you your liver on the pointy enemy hook! Oh. Uh, you are infected with the pox after all. I'm so sorry, Guybrush. Somehow I feel this is all my fault. Yeah, yeah. Not it is. to worry, boy. We'll get these artifacts, find La Esponja Grande, and have you cured in no time. Ooh. Whoa! Oh, Whoa! No. Oh no, no, Whoa. no! Guybrush? Hmm, that big guy has the artifact. If I run up and take it from him, McGillicutty would probably make me first in command. Heck, he might even let me eat this week. What? Then again, he is pretty big. I better gather some men. Ow. Oh, ow. Oh, la Chuck! I was right! I knew I couldn't trust him! Oh no, the summoning artifact! Oh no! What will we do now that LeChuck is holding the summoning artifact? Will he try to run off with it? Find out next time on Let's Play Tales of Monkey Island. Thank you for watching and have a good day.